Hey creators, today I'm going to show you how to make your own custom desktop wallpaper using the web graphics creator. We're going to create uh, a, uh, an image like, let me get rid of this real quick. We're going to create an image like this, but custom. So we're going to go pick a template set. Uh, let's do the scenery creator for now. It really doesn't matter. And for demo purposes, we're going to pick, I don't know, uh, let's try this one. That's a good one. Okay, I'm going to get rid of all the graphics on this for now. And I'm going to keep the text. I'm going to delete this text and delete this. And now I'm going to find out the size of my monitor. Now I have a Mac, so I can do this on my Mac, about this Mac, and go to my displays. And I can see the size of my monitor. I have two monitors connected, and I have a big one and a... 23 inch one. Okay, now on Windows you can do the same thing by going to your displays. But what you want to do is get the size, okay? So here's the size of my 20 inch monitor and here's the size of my uh, 23 inch monitor connected to my to my uh, desktop computer. Okay, um, so the web graphics creator has a maximum size now of 5,000 pixels by 5,000 pixels. So it almost works for this. So I'm going to go format my canvas to be 5,000 by 2880. So I'm going to go to format and the width is 5,000 by, I could type it in here, 2880. Okay, now this is a pretty good size graphic. Um, it looks small in the web graphics creator, but it's only really viewing it at 28%. Um, but when I export it, it'll be as big as my desktop. So now I'm going to utilize the photos option here. And I'm going to type in uh, something that I like. Uh, you might want to type in Hawaii or beautiful pictures or flowers. Uh, I'm going to type in lion, for example. I like this image. Okay, I'm going to scroll down and I see a great picture here. I'm going to bring it over and I'm going to size it pretty easily to this entire uh, graphic size here. I'll close this. And I'm going to click the graphic and set it to the back. And here is my text. I can uh, type in a motivational quote or something or my name. All right, something like that. Put it here. And then all I'm going to do is export this graphic. I'm going to down, hit the download button here. And I can call this. OK, download. And now go to my system preferences and click on my desktop and screensaver. And then I'm simply going to go to where I downloaded the graphic, which is my downloads folder. And there it is. And select my desktop. And there you go. Close that. Minimize that so we can see what we did. And bam, a custom desktop wallpaper image. And it, that's pretty high resolution. Okay, I hope you enjoyed this really cool trick. Um, so go out and make your own custom desktop wallpapers and uh, post what you make. I'd like to see what you, uh, what you create. Take some screenshots of your desktop and uh, post them in the, in the uh, Web Graphics Creator Facebook group. All right, thanks for watching. Go have fun.